Ukiah native Andrew Corpus says he got lucky when his touring company decided to audition for America's Got Talent this season and needed some extra hands and feet. Now he has appeared with Diavolo, a dance troupe from Los Angeles, on the hit talent show hosted by Tyra Banks, Heidi Klum and Howie Mandel. To be on the show was really exciting, seeing the behind the scenes and seeing the other great acts was unbelievable, to be in the same room as those groups and individuals, said Corpus. He appeared on episode 10 of this season, his group climbing and jumping on a huge moving staircase that at one point split in two, complete with a smoke machine. Corpus is in his second year at the Diavolo Institute, where he is a performing and teaching artist. He leads movement and trust workshops with fellow dancers, acting as a professional performer and creator for the touring company in that role. He traces the start of his dance career five years back to Mendocino College in Ukiah, where he got into capoeira, a Brazilian martial art combining dance, acrobatics and music. He said he was helped by the college's dance department founder, Leslie Saxon West, who taught there for 35 years. Saxon West helped him finesse his dance skills and helped him on his way to perform in college musicals, his first being Cats. Corpus later performed in the Nutcracker with the Mendocino Ballet. With the dance program, it really helped me realize that the arts and inspiring people is something I really enjoy doing, he said. It's nice that it's a positive environment and everyone is really supportive. Without that, I may not have got the confidence to attempt to go out and make something of it. On the show, Diavolo has 20 dancers showcasing a variety of styles, including modern, ballet, hip-hop and martial arts, while using props from everyday objects to large-scale pieces of architecture, like the time they performed on a giant rocking structure, Corpus said although he is grateful to have been on America's Got Talent, it was also exhausting. It was a fun experience, he said, but not one that he would want to relive because of its grueling schedule. It did and team mean that much to be on the show as much as getting the chance and acknowledgement from the touring company that I am a possible candidate as a future performer for their touring company when they decide to have auditions again, he said. Advertisement Corpus hopes to join Diavola's performing ranks in the future and has immense respect for what its dancers do. Being able to work with them really gave me insight on what it means to be a Diavolo dancer, he said. What I found is that it truly takes incredible, strong people, both physically and mentally, to be able to do the work that we do. I've never seen so many bruises, cuts and scrapes on individuals before. Catch Diavolo Dance Troupe on Tuesday performing in the semifinals at 8 p.m. on NBC.